through a lifetime spent in the pursuit of knowledge, one question consumed me. How oh, it looks beautiful. Come to be? The old ones perished a thousand years ago, triggering the extinction of all life. She showed me how it was reborn. A little outcast girl, ignorant of her own importance. That was the through first her, game. I learned that life was only saved through a technological miracle. Zero uh -huh. Dawn. A terraforming system composed of nine subordinate functions. Each playing its part to reshape Earth from a barren rock to a lush landscape. Tended and protected by the machines. Until they were corrupted. And with her, I learned the deepest secret of them all. The secret of her birth. That she is a clone of Elizabeth Subek, Zero Dawn's creator. Born to prevent a new extinction. Driven by Hades, a malevolent AI. Given sentience by a mysterious signal of unknown origin. And with a little help from me. She prevailed in a great battle at the city of Meridian. Becoming a champion for all humankind. But as useful as she has been, now I must leave her behind. For as she strives to put right what Hades sundered, I have made a new discovery. The Forbidden West. One that heralds both destruction and opportunity. Interesting. What's going on, guys? Back at it again with another Let's Play. This one in particular, as you guys can see right in front of you, is on Horizon Forbidden West. If you guys remember, I actually played Horizon Zero Dawn here on the channel uh, a while ago now. Uh, a little over a year ago, I think it was. And I gotta say... It was one of my favorite games, till this day, of last generation. So needless to say, I am beyond excited to play Horizon Forbidden West. Ever since it got announced, I've been hype about it. I can't wait to play this game. I am just ecstatic at the fact that I get to play this game and it's finally in my hands. I am playing this on the PS5. Guys, the nature of these games though... If you guys remember, the last Let's Play is pretty long, so this is probably going to be a very long Let's Play, which is 100% okay with me because I enjoyed every second of for, of uh, Zero Dawn. So if that's a ride you guys want to take, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed, because guess what? It really does help this channel grow. So enough yapping from me, guys. I really want to jump on this game as soon as possible. Uh, if you guys notice, I literally added the whole beginning part of this game before this intro, because that's how the game launches, right? So I, I don't know. I'm ready to jump in. If you guys are excited, let's go ahead and watch this video. <laughs> Oh, the haptics feel amazing on this. And it's just starting. I could feel the footsteps, the running, the vibrations. I love the haptics on the PS5 controller, man. Oh my god, that's gorgeous. That's gorgeous. The land is dying. Are the corrupted a thing People still? People are suffering. Soon, they'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. 
only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. Aww. And then... Extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AIU designed to control the system. She's so beautiful, man. I, I'm, I love e Aloy so much. But every time I think I have a lead, it comes to nothing. Look at that. That's the look of determination. And every night, I have the same dream. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth. Waiting for me. Even though it's, you've been dead for a thousand years. It's like she considers her, her mom. You're the kind of is. person I've ever had to a mother. <laughs> there you go. <clears throat> Aww. And for a moment, I feel whole. But it never lasts. What's going on? <clears throat> she fears the current left situation. Is that a necklace? From her dream? This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. Oh! Varl? <laughs> if it isn't Aloy. I remember him. Savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. <coughs> that one was in your honor. Just saying. So, what are we doing? Must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? <laughs> or maybe it has something to do with the blight. Both, actually. But, um... I, I should... Oh, no. I've been tracking you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you, no matter what. But you're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. Do we have companions? <clears throat> okay. But if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <gasps> she has an extra. Focus. Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device we've got a lot to cover um i'll have to explain everything as we go you see like this all the time since i was a little girl come on
God, this game is gorgeous. Doesn't surprise me because the last one was gorgeous. And that was on the PS4. Please tell me he's actually going to be a companion. I would love that. I haven't been keeping up with the news because... I like to play the game organically. Scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants. Stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds oh, good. Oh yeah. Let's get started. All right. Reach the stars. Gather medicinal sky brush. These plants don't look like the ones in the sacred lands. The focus helps you see the ones we need. Ugh. Bitter. Yeah, well, at least they make you feel better. Okay. Right, we should keep going. It says, eat Might medicinal berry? Okay, yeah, I already did it. Yeah, good idea. Alright. Let's go! Yeah, <laughs> we're actually controlling Aloy now, dude. I'm so excited. I don't know put these ropes here, but we can use the line to slide down. Oh, nice. an AI. It's, um, it's hard to explain. Think of it like... Oh, I can't climb that? ...a set of instructions that can fix the world. I can't hear Varl at all. He's too far. Maybe I should slow down. We're into some trouble on the way here. Lost a lot of my gear. Hmm. There's gotta be a way. Maybe if I... Scan, I'll be able to find. Light. It's everywhere. Might want to grab more of these plants along the way. Yeah, good idea. Oh, never mind. There's no climbing involved yet. It's literally just go around. Oh my god, this game is gorgeous. You guys are probably getting tired of me saying that over and over and over, but I gotta say, this game is amazing looking. Like they left the that was 100% an accident. <laughs> I'm already gonna get myself killed. I think I was supposed to go down here anyway, so... I guess I didn't mess anything up. A lot of arrows in that machine. Better take a closer look. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else would come arrows. I Can know. I loot it? We better craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble up ahead. There's some ridgewood by the stream. Where? Ridgewood. Oh, these things right here. Got it. <coughs> We're gonna All craft right. our first set of arrows. Now to craft some arrows. Hold on. Let me grab these berries real quick. Okay, so hold L1. Okay, good. We got full arrows. Arrows ready. Cool. I'm not gonna go uh, and use up all my arrows yet. Nothing a well placed arrow can't knock free. Get the lock. After you. Nice. So there's a little bit of thinking involved nothing too serious obviously but by the goddess what was this place i don't know, I don't know. the transmission the uh, message i felt didn't say only that a backup might be here what is this we need to find a way in oh it's a fox can we skip poisoning plants it's killing animals too then Find will get sick the too. entrance and starve. We're not gonna let that happen. So, um, what happened after I left Meridian? Well, there was a fuss when people realized you were gone. But then some of us figured you only would have left if it were for something important. You were right about that. Hmm. I gotta figure out how to get over there or inside. And I can't go that way, so this is a dead end. 
This definitely is the get out of my way, Varl. That's always been the problem with companions, huh? They always like to get in the way of things. Or like if you're playing Fallout, for example, or any Bethesda title, they like to stand in between doorways or entry points. Hmm. I will figure this out. Something killed a bunch of things. Gotta shoot him in the face. Those dead machines have it all alert. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. How do I hold R3? Wait a second. Okay. See how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. Okay, concentrate. I'm ready. He's actually going to fight! Oh, what did he just do? I remember this. Oh, God. Got him. Oh, that was cool. Take all. Another one's coming. Nice try there, buddy. I can't believe we have a freaking companion. How does the focus know all that? It reads data on the machine. Like a hunter studying its prey? Yeah, kind of. So, really quick. I did pre-order this. So, how do I use my new outfit? I don't even know what it's called, to be honest. Is it this one? It can't be this one, right? Mm. I I don't know. I legitimately don't know. So after the fuss of me leaving, what do I else do? Yeah, found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. It's good to have extras. I've, I like Varl. I've, I've liked Varl even in the last game, so... I can't wait. Oh, toggle circle to crouch. Yeah, I already know that. I already discovered that. I already know how to sprint. Thank you. I just don't want to sprint. I don't want to be too fast. God has protect us. Because, uh... Okay, it's really easy to leave your companion behind. Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? What is that? <gasps> I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but... Why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them? Please hold for a dentist scan. <laughs> Access denied. Please wait here for personnel to assist you. Dr. Sobek. Okay. I guess they weren't on great terms with Elizabeth. Well, huh. let's find a way in. There's gotta be a way in anyways. Do I shove my stick in this too? Absolutely. Nothing. Something's never changed. It's climbing gear. Yes, someone dropped in from above. Whoever left this here might have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? It's a good question. Give me this. I may need some more bullets. Stench. What? I doubt. They must have come here to delve for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. <coughs> and it looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. 
Oh wow. Not through the wall. <coughs> then they came Take this a way. Look at the rubble in that gap. Hold on, I want to investigate first. All right. Aloy, you gotta hold your horses. You you never know what we're gonna find. See, like this. Chilled water. Oops. Okay. Since I'm supposed to go that way, I'm gonna continue looking in this direction just in case we see anything to take along with us. Ooh, look, it's a training dummy. I wonder if I could use it. Hiya! Oh, she looks so sick. Okay, there's nothing over here though. So let's go ahead and continue with our objective. Come on, Varl. We got somewhere to be. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Do I hit it with a stick? Yeah. Hey, Lloyd, over here. Where? I think I got something. What is it? It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. He's the smart. Focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Okay, well, I see one thing. Poor guy. There. Acid burned right through his armor. Well, the gameplay so far feels top notch, I gotta say. Granted, it's only the beginning, but. Part of the machine could help fix the gears. Anything else? No? Oh, there's something over here. Bag of supplies. This should be the last of it, right? I only saw two things. Machine cable. Stronger than rope. Alright, I think I have what I need to repair the tool. Or maybe even make something better. You could use hmm. this workbench. Okay. Is that what that was? That's a workbench? There's workbenches now? Because that wasn't in the previous games, was it? Or is that just something I never did? Craft this. Absolutely. The pull caster. There. Uh, pull caster. Now to test it on the debris. Okay. The pull caster is, versatile, is a versatile tool that allows you to manipulate objects in the environment that have a gra uh, graded pattern. Okay, so I see. Uh, to wield. So held L2. No, wait. Graded pattern. This? Okay, so maybe I didn't see what she was talking about. Okay. I legitimately do not see Looks like this was part a graded machine. pattern. It must be huge if that's just one piece. I think I just need to see one to really understand what they mean by graded pattern. Because whatever it is I need to pull, it is there. Oh! Oh! So 
So that was just one. Dude, she is buff. I'd never be able to do that. And I'll work out. Not really. What's this? Huh. What's this thing for? All three of us said the same thing. Whoa. Good morning. I'm Oswald Dalgard, and it is my Oswald Cobblepot to introduce you to Far Zenith. Forget what you think you know about us. Our truth is simple. We say reach for the stars, even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space to get there. Please proceed into the auditorium, where we'll unveil our plans. If you say so. Wonder what's in this auditorium. This didn't turn up much. Guess we'll find out. I'm assuming I have to go over here? Oh, wait. Can I use... Probably not. Use your focus to learn more about your surroundings. I should open up my focus display and see what I can find. Oh, I might be able to get up there. I mean, that's what I've been doing, but it didn't. I I'm doing this right. Oh, I see. I see. I get it now. Wow, that works. That pull caster's useful. It is. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry, I'll find you another way up. Okay. Well, that didn't work. Let's try that again. <laughs> I'm already pretty horrible at this game, aren't I? That pull caster really comes in handy. What are you doing? Go that way. Okay. Does this mean I can grab it? Yes, I can. Uncharted vibes. No, what are you... Oh, dude, I really thought she jumped off. I was about to say. Okay, I need... Can I just jump on this? I... Definitely did not mean to do that. Okay, third time's a charm. At least now I'm understanding a little bit better. So bear with me. Come on, Aloy, hurry up. Don't, no. Why did she jump that way? It's supposed to just drop, right? So far, the, the climbing seems a little primitive almost, really. Which is weird because everything else feels so much better so far. Oh, I was pushing the wrong button, that's why. Okay, what can I grapple to? Can I just jump there? There we go. That was scary. We almost fell. Okay, I gotta drop the ladder for Varl. Well, that didn't do anything. Do I just have to walk up and... Yeah. Obviously, right? There you go, Burl. Thanks. He really needs his own... little pull caster. Gorgeous. Humans, Homo sapiens. Us. That's me. We have always pushed the boundary as explorers, pioneers, trailblazers. And now Far Zenith is taking the next leap into the future. That's why we're proud to have resurrected the Odyssey. When our government's abandoned in orbit, Far Zenith will actualize in less than a decade. But that's only the beginning. 
When the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. A serious system. There will create humanity's first off-world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it, but when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chimbumbe, the truest form of immortality is data corrupt. <laughs> the playback stopped. Oh, that the sucks. Could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Yep. Uh, well, yes, sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. Did they? Did they cover that in the previous game? I don't remember. Is that why Elizabeth gave them a backup of Gaia? For their colony? Probably. Makes sense. Error. Public presentation file corrupted. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Yeah. Yes. Reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. We all know the projections. Economic instability, new biocontagions, rampant AIs. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? We here at Far Zenith believe, escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. That's the now Odyssey, we've right? What we're building here. Infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction. A state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest and join us. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. They just didn't know how. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity, it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, well, didn't work out for them in the end. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. There, the backup. It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. Let's get it. Okay. The have really grown over this place. I'm getting used to it. Dude, she is buff. I'm staying away from that. Whoa. What is that? That is not good. Oh, my guard is up here. More friendly creatures. Some friends from underground. You take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. Oh, please tell me this is an actual game mechanic. Moving up. I need to sneak up on him to take it out with my spear. Can I gotta wait. Me? I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. 
sir. And stay out of sight. Tag target. Highlight track. Alright, so where is he going? So if I just... I should just be able to sneak up behind him. I just poked him in the booty. I'm pretty sure Varl just killed the other one. Mine's down too. I heard it. Can I not climb up this? Where'd you kill yours, Varl? Oh, right here. Got it. Perfect. You gotta get everything we need, man. Crafting supplies, baby. Let's go. Wait, which way are we supposed to go? Up this way, maybe? More of those machines ahead. Nothing more that I can't handle. Honestly, if I just wait here... Oh, that scared me. If I just wait here, it's... Actually, you know what? Let's anticipate his path. Don't look at me. Are you ready for this? Let's go. So far, so good. <gasps> you see nothing. You know what? He wasn't facing us anyways. Get out of here. You deserve none of me. Did I just see another one? I did. Ancient supply chest? Sure. It's trying to take pictures of me. I'm coming for you, buddy. No, I'm not. Dude, we're like the stealth masters at this point. Well, she said we got them all, so we're good. I noticed you have a new look these days. Yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. Don't worry, it's not permanent. Good. Sorry my whiskers offend you, anointed. Looks like this little guy got caught up in the bite. Aww. I couldn't escape. I hope it didn't suffer long. Me too, that's sad. Where am I supposed to go? This way. The blight looks really dangerous, man. The Wait. Must have used explosives against the machines. They managed to get a couple. Looks like there was a barricade here. The machines must have broken through. I didn't even see this guy. Oh no, a corpse. Later. Guess that officer didn't have a chance to use it. Careful. Traps ahead. Oh. Huh. Might be able to disarm them. Okay, that's good. I don't want to get too close and die. There. Managed to salvage some supplies. Dismantle it. Not blow yourself up. Got more supplies. That was easy enough. Looks like another camp. While we're here. Maybe we can make some traps of our own. Might come in handy against machines. Good idea. Yeah, for sure. Excuse me, Varl. I gotta get some supplies. I can use this. It's. I gotta say, it is kind of. Okay. Should have what I need to craft a trap. Um, how do I craft a trap? So hold down, 
craft. Let's craft as many as possible. So I can only do two because I salvaged the supplies, I'm assuming. If anything walks into one of those, oh, oh that's scary. Whoops. <gasps> I've seen this machine before. A scrounger. That's new to me. Let's see where its weak points are. Maybe it's a What's the point of weak points when you can just stealth attack them? I hear another one though. Is it is it coming? Okay, so you're going that other way. So I'm going to keep you tracked. But I got to be careful. Because he's going to be able to find me easily. Oh, dude, this is like the perfect spot for an ambush. Come here, buddy. Come here. Come here, cutie. Psych. You done, though. Let's keep going then. The gameplay is solid. Solid. Whoa. That machine we saw earlier must be on the move. Let's hope it doesn't come this way. Damn, she could jump far. Not only is she buff, but she has like Spider-Man levels of athletics. Open this door. Open sesame. That's a big storm picking up out there. That's not good. And they're getting stronger. And more frequent. So the storms, the blighted lands, the rivers and lakes choked with algae. You were born to fix all that? Yeah. But I can only do it if I find that backup. I think we're winding our way around to the data center. We'll need to cut through that big building on the right out there. This data mentions the tech that Far Zenith traded with Zero Dawn. What's in here? It doesn't explain Aloy, how we got it back. Come check this out. I already read that. For more data. At least he tells me when there's data Let's available. See. Huh. A lot of glyphs. Okay. I'll tuck this away to study later. Looks like we've got to climb up. Okay, so I see it. It's right there, but. Let me loot this real quick. But I could also go up this way. So it looks like there's multiple points on f entry. You okay? That almost killed yeah. me. Guess we won't be going that way. So this way was the right way. Wait, hold on. Slower this, just in case we fall. I'm sure that's what that's there for. Uh oh. Well, it is a thousand years old. It'll happen. Don't die, Varl. Looks like some kind of meeting room. That door on the other side's locked. There's no. Oh, I didn't think he was gonna say anything else. And zoo. The Zero Dawn terraforming system, the brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek, empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering, an obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase One Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase two, the asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. 
Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades protocol. In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. They were on to her. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? Uh, she kind of is me. Kind of. It's okay, Paul. We look alike because we're the exact same. Genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? Because I wasn't born. I was made. By a machine. It's why I'm motherless. Why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. Yep. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup is like a set of instructions? It's more than that. It's called Gaia. And for a long time, she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself. So she made me to bring her back. I'm the only one who can. And this place is my last hope. You once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into All Mother Mountain. Was that this Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Laurel. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. <sighs> I've had a lot of time to figure this out. And you will too, with the focus. But for now... The report said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? Yeah, he's misunderstanding technology for a god entity, you know? To, to his point, though, there is no real way to know if there's a god or not. So, like, you can't prove or disprove by science of whether or not there's a god or not, right? So, at least not yet. Aloy, over here. I found something you could use. A weapon. Thanks, Ma. What is it? We should keep moving. After you. Yeah, so I don't I don't blame him for misunderstanding technology, you know? Ooh, I got a slingshot. Blast lings launch bomb that affect large areas. This weapon fires frost bombs. Use them against enemies to build up to the brittle state when in the brittle state enemies are more vulnerable to impact damage okay it's also showing me what the designs are like the what they mean right so impact damage and brittle damage good to know down here Ow, but at least I fell right onto a supply I think chest. We're almost back outside. Good. I hope so. How do you know? You can't tell from here. Oh, I guess you can. By the light. Look, that must be the machine. It's heading in the same direction we're going. Right. One of those machines. That is a really big <laughs> snake. Bring back. Okay. I think I want to stay with this for now. Who is this guy? So, weakness. Hold on. What was his weakness again? I don't know what those are. So, I'm just going to shoot at his weakness. I think we fought these guys anyways. Hit him with the power attack! Oh, he hit me hard. 
Did I kill him? Nope. I can't see him on this angle. Alright, he's dead. He destroyed a lot of people. I should probably heal. They didn't stand a chance. Good. Gotta loot all of this. Give me all of it. So, you said this backup is the last hope. Yeah. All those places I've been these last few months. There were supposed to be more backups. But a thousand years ago, a guy named Ted Farrow purged them all. Was he part of Far Zenith too? No. He was worse. God, this game is gorgeous, dude. It's unbelievable. What? That's not what I wanted. I wanted to slide. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme. Gimme all of the Ridgewood. I'm assuming we're going the right way. That big metal thing looks like the ship we saw back in the auditorium. We're also on Imagine going up to the stars in that. These guys couldn't catch a break. Probably not. Machine so, patrolling ahead. We can tag them in the focus to keep track of them. Okay, we tagged that one. We may need supplies. Hold on, there's a little bit of brush here and I might be able to take one out using this. Be careful, Varl. I wonder if they could see Varl if he stays outside of the sneak area. So how many are there? Two of them? So we got that one tagged. We don't have that one tagged. I don't think we can attack this guy. <clears throat> yes, we can. Never say no to me. Uh-oh. Well, he's over here. I might be able to find a place to sneak... ...over here, right? It's coming back, isn't it? Oh, crap. I'm not worried about it. Varl's just chilling there. How did he not see Varl? Oh, there's another one right... Ooh. I want to kill him, though. Dunzo. Ooh, the stealth is so freaking good. Machine ripped right through the wall. There's a ladder in the back. I saw. Oh, come on. I missed. Wait. Can I not click on this? Maybe I have to do this? I have no idea what that means, but okay, sure, why not? Oh, that's Varl? Loki, that scared me. I'm like, who is this guy? Some random dude just standing there? I'm like, what? Sona was really okay with you not going back to the sacred lands as the Nora war chief she understood why I was obligated to follow you but as my mother she wasn't pleased is she ever pleased I don't think I've seen her smile me neither <laughs> she was tough I liked her a lot oh 
Okay. This is very intricate, isn't it? There's a lot of things to traverse through in this game. All right, what do we got here? They're like, they're cobras. Oh, God. Things. And if they slaughtered all those Osirum, we'll never get through to the data center. There's no way to slip past them. They're too tough to fight head on. We could find a settlement, convince some hunters to help us. That would take weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fall. That thing? How? We'll figure it out. Just wait here. Aloy. Trust me. And there she goes. <laughs> just need to... Oh, still just as cool as it was in the last game. Maybe I should sneak. If I can make it to that tower, I should be able to find a way across to the shuttle. Oh, Donzo. Ten stealth kills. Did I just see another one? Okay, there's one right there, but I gotta be careful not to be seen by him. <coughs> Highlight track. Oh, come on! Oh no! I'm not really worried about these guys because these guys really aren't that tough. I didn't see them. Oh, what? Dunzo. Was that? Where did the other one go? You don't see how it's hard to breathe around this stuff. Yeah. Is he dead? Okay. That was horrible. So much for my fantastic stealth capabilities. Wait, hold on. I need to craft these bad boys. Maybe I should stay in stealth. Go to the shuttle. Well, I'm almost there. It's not that far, and I think... That ladder can get me up to the tower. What ladder? Aloy, what? Oh, okay, I see it. Aloy, there you go. Got a lot of stalactites. Uh. Where? Oh. No. Okay, so I gotta. I didn't get up high enough. I better try this again. So, oh man, I fell. Okay, I gotta, I gotta see. Let me see. Jump and tap, and right before reaching the grapple point. Oh, okay. Got it. 
Oh, that was sick! Ooh, I love that. That's gonna let me get to like a lot of places I can't, I couldn't reach before, you know? I gotta remember a lot of buttons though. Where am I going? Well, first of all, there's this. Second of all, there's this. Oh, I've always loved this. Come on. The storm's getting bad. Run! So long, there were three giant machines killing us and leaving acid everywhere. Great. Wait, hold on. Oh, this way. Oh. Be careful, a dude. Imagine. Oh hell no. One rickety tower down. On to the next. I hate high. Uh, I'm so scared of heights, man. Holy crap! Well, nowhere to go but up. This place is barely holding together. Barely is right. This reminds me a lot of uh, Uncharted, almost. Like massive clamps holding the shuttle in place. I'll bet there's a control console nearby. If I can release the clamps, the shuttle should fall right into the basin. What am I looking for? Oh, oh it just took a little bit of time to. More machines, you say? Where? Okay. Is he... He's suspicious of us? You don't see nothing, little guy. My God, control console might be in there. I gotta, I gotta hide. Oh, oh, I got scared. I shouldn't have run! Okay, we're good. We're good. I- I do want- Really? Time out! Alright, time out. <laughs> I tried to loot. Maybe I gotta stop being selfish. Alright, let's go. You saw nothing. Oh, come on. Let's go! Oh! I'm gonna get you melee style, buddy! Even if it costs me all of my medical supplies. It's gonna cost me all my medical supplies. Really? It's just me and you, buddy. You're done, though. And done, though. This place to myself now. 
That was scary. Oh, I got no... I got no more medical supplies. I got this, but I don't want that. I don't want to use that right now. So I got to scrounger some uh, medical supplies. Crush those machines down below. Oh, this is going to be cool to watch. It didn't work. Yes, it did. It didn't work. The shuttle's caught up in those cables. I'm gonna have to climb the tower to find a way to disconnect them. I think we found our way. Now, how to get up the tower? Scanning with my focus could help here. Let's see here. I don't see anything. Oh. This got to do something, right? Okay, now what? There we go. Should be just a straight shot now, right? The climbing is not bad. It reminds me a lot of the previous game and even a little bit of hints of like Uncharted and stuff. So it's not revolutionary in any sense, but it works so far. I'm trying. I'm trying to go. What are you doing? Oh, we're almost there. I don't know how she could do this, man. I would literally pee myself. There. The connector's holding the cables together. It should break if I shoot it. Oh. Let me get. Was it a mistake? Going down. I just need to climb higher and attach the second set of cables. Dude, what the hell? How am I supposed to? I'm gonna have to kill myself, aren't I? Oh crap! Well, I killed myself. How many more do we have? Just one? Scaling an ancient rickety tower with killer machines waiting down below. I knew I was right. No turning back now. I can't believe we got stuck. Wait, where? Oh, this way. I'm pretty sure I just saw something on my left. I did not. I am imagining things. Ooh, got a health. I don't really need it yet. Almost there. I'd rather scavenge for stuff anyways. There's the other connector. Let's not jump down there this time. There it goes. Hey, it worked. I bet you one survived and it's gonna be a boss fight. Oh, that's not good. Ooh. 
Oh, that is not good at all. <laughs> no way in hell, dude. <laughs> good for you, but no way in hell. I I knew it. Finishing this the hard way. I knew it. I need to take this thing down to get to the data center. I should scan for weak spots. Okay, what's that weak spot? Where is the weak spots? Is it the throat? I got one. Whoa! Fuck! Now that I know it could do that, I'm kind of scared. Why am I in the fire? Oh, 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 dude, he's got, he can snipe. Got him. Hold on, time out. Woo! Uh-oh. Ah! What is it doing? What is it doing when it does that? There we go. Where's the other one? Ah! Oh no, it's still spinning at me. I thought he couldn't spit at me no more. Ah! That's not a smart idea. I need to use one already. I need to get that other freaking canister. It's it moves a lot though, so it's really hard to hit. Oh! Got him. Oh, come on. Was that the killer blow? That's not good. Where's Barrel? Damn it, 
broke free. I gotta take this thing down fast. Trap me. Lost ammo. Well, my focus might find something I can use around here. Run. Where is he? Oh, God. I see you. What's he trying to do? Oh! What am I stuck on? Oh. Oh no, he got me. It's hard to get him on his weakness because he moves a lot. Got him. Oh, that was so good. Level two reached. Finally. That felt good. Not gonna lie. That felt really good. Spend skill points? Sure, why not? <clears throat> Increase range combat effectiveness and improve weapon stamina and concentration. Includes weapon techniques for hunter bows and bolt caster, which spe specialize in mid range combat. Survivor. Increase the effectiveness of healing and potions and gain benefits while in low health. Includes weapon techniques for blastlings and shred go uh, shredder gauntlets. I don't even know what those are. Infiltrator. Reduce visibil uh, visibility and movement noise and increase damage dealt while in stealth. Includes weapon techniques for sharp shot bows which specialize in long range combat. That sounds pretty good, actually. <clears throat> Machine Master. Increase the effectiveness of overriding machines and the durability and damage dealt from overridden uh, machines. Includes weapon techniques for spike throwers, which excel against large machines. Okay, so that was Hunter. Trapper. Increase the effectiveness of food and traps. Is eating a thing? And the amount of traps that would be placed uh, includes weapon techniques for trip caster and rope casters. Okay. Unlock new melee combos and increase melee damage and effectiveness. Includes weapon techniques for warrior bows, which specialize in close quarter combat. I kind of like infiltrator, man. So, sun strike. Sun Strike deals more damage approach an enemy undetected when and when prompt trapped uh to I I mean I love this anyway so I'm going to go ahead and do this Can I get another one? Deal more uh ranged impact damage while in stealth. I like that. What about this one? Uh deal more tear damage while in stealth, increasing the ability to remove the, an enemy's armor and parts from machines. I don't know, that's really good. I can't get anything anyways. Okay, I gotta wait. The data center should be straight ahead. I guess Farl's gonna have to find another way there. Stop off. Let's look around and see if there's any more. To loot. I could have literally used this against him. Oops. But I want to see how it shoots though.
That's cool. Oh, I see. Health already. Give three. Okay. Definitely gonna need some more sticks, of course. AKA Ridgewood. AKA sticks. Cause I'm gonna be crafting a lot of bows, man. I mean, uh, arrows. Is that all the health around here, though? I don't see anything else. Let's get out of here. Go to the data center. Once I get the backup, I can reboot Gaia, fix the system, heal the blight, restore Elizabeth's dream. Ooh, that was a cool boss fight. Okay, I should find the server room. I knew that that was gonna happen though. It was, it was obvious, man. It happens in games all the time. I'm close. I have to be. Maybe. Maybe not. But if Aloy says it, it has to be true, right? I remember all of this. What's this? Gimme, gimme, gimme. I got a key. Nothing else over here? Cool. Did I see something over here? No. Okay. Through the door it is. <clears throat> Where'd Varl go? Is he seriously still back there? Reach for the stars. It's here. Gaia version 6.9. Initializing. Hello. Hi. Elizabeth? <gasps> What's this we got here? A Farzan's conspiracy to steal a copy of Gaia? And her subordinate functions? <laughs> naughty, naughty. You want me to handle this, Liz? Blasphemers! Brood of vipers! With a mighty head, I smite and pour troubles upon you! Thou shall not steal. Super advanced terraforming system. This ain't no copy of guy you stole, you losers. But it's the mother of all logic bombs. So good luck repairing your data. And next time you start thinking you can outsmart a tape, remember my salute. Of course. He seems like a grade-A douche. Oh no, keep your head up, Aloy. Aloy? The goddess. There is no goddess. I told you that already. That's not Gaia. That's not what I'm looking for. It's nothing but a fake. Keep your head up, Aloy. It's just a setback. We'll figure it out. God, Gorge, look at this. I got it. For a I'm sorry. You have a sharp bite sometimes, you know. But it was pretty amazing to see you fly off that tower and blow up the entire basin. <laughs> the thing is, um, there's going to be more of that. I'm out of leads, Farl. But I, I have to keep searching. And fast, and whatever risks I have to take, I will. 
And it doesn't make sense to have someone with me. Someone who might get hurt. This is on me, Farrell. Nobody else. Hold on. Before, in Meridian, you said there was a man who helped you. Silence. You said you used to talk to him a lot about things you discovered from the old world, things no one else understands. And he gave you the lance you used to defeat Hades. He's gone, Varl. I haven't heard from him since the battle against Hades. Sure, but Spymaster Murad back in Meridian, he's good at finding people, isn't he? Varl, I... <sighs> Come on, it might work. Plus, you'll get to see some friendly faces again. <laughs> okay. I... I guess it's worth a shot. We've got a long walk ahead. So we're going to Meridian? Actually... <laughs> I've got a better idea. Hey, we got some horses. Hey, look at him. He does not know how to ride. That's funny. He's like a baby to all of this. The interlude point of the la of the lance. That's Meridian for sure. I remember Meridian. It's a beautiful city. It's also where the Sun King, I believe, is what his name was. By the sun, it's true. She's come back. Bless us. The savior of Meridian has returned. You earned this welcome. You saved them. Not yet. In the name of the Sun King of Vard, a the Sun King. Welcome for the champion. <coughs> Make way. Murad, Aloy has an urgent matter to discuss. Dashane, that makes two of us. I've sent forth hunters for weeks. The sun fall all the way to the sacred land, searching for you. Something happened at the spire. I'll show you. This can't be good. <clears throat> Watch your step. You saved us all to be sure, but uh, we're still cleaning up the mess. <laughs> so pay attention. It happened right after the solstice. We were able to explain it away, thank the sun. Otherwise, it might have caused a panic. Is it, is it rainy? Hey, they have a statue of us. One night for less than half a minute, it glowed an angry red. From Meridian, it looked like a trick of the lights. But those who were closer, atop the light, said it could not have been a reflection. Much to my dismay, they said the light rose up from the tower's base. From that. We left everything just as it was. What do you think happened? I don't know. The Spire's supposed to send out signals, messages, the terraforming system. But Hades tried to use it to wake up ancient war machines. I'm sure I got the connection to that thing. Wait here while I check it out. Let us know what you find. He's gonna get tired of being told to wait here. Uh, examine the orb that contained Hades. Oh, that should be interesting. Can we scan it? Processor. Quantum processing module heavily damaged. That's literally where the... Oh, this is literally... I don't know. Looks the same as before. I recognize this place. This is where we literally had the final major battle with Hades. And then we stabbed it with that lance. Let's find out. I could pull this thing out of the box. What? It's broken?
What? What happened? No, he wouldn't. He couldn't. He took the original, didn't Something he? Something was transmitted from the top of the spire. I guess I have to find a way up there. Climb to the base of the spire? How do I do that? Okay, so it can't be that. Right here. Uh, maybe I can jump to that ledge behind me. Got it. Okay, now where? Gotta figure this out. Wait. Not without taking this first. Um, that way. Oh, I hate these. <gasps> oh, come on. At least, at least I didn't get that far. Period. There we go. Can we just run on it? Okay, there we go. Get your butt over here. There we go. Good job, Aloy. Still amazing as always. Now, how to cross over to the spire. Should be able to get up there now. Okay, so jump. I thought Silence was helping me when he gave me his lance. But it looks like he tricked me. I transmitted something through the spire. Did he save Hades? <clears throat> Why would he do that? Well, if I can figure out where he sent it, I can track him down. Hopefully the transmission note at the top will tell me. Oh, it doesn't look like I can keep climbing this way. Okay, so I gotta go left. Why would he transmit Hades though? That he was a little shady. Can I go up through the inside? Oh hell no! Nah. That's that's a no go for me there, citizen. Yeah, he was always shady, but never like that, you know. Carja, I forgot about the Carja. There's the note. Moment of truth, I guess. The Forbidden West. Well, Eloy, I see you finally figured it out. To be honest, I'm surprised it took you so long to discover my rules. You raped the lands to steal Hades. How could you be so reckless? Reckless? You're the one who tried to purge Hades before its precious knowledge could be... extracted. The mysterious signal that woke it, for example. But why don't you one of those guy up back that you've been having such a hard time finding? If 
you knew, why didn't you just tell me? I've been having problems of my own these past six months, Eloy. The difference is, I've made progress. So once your anger at my entirely necessary deception has faded, now why don't you come out here and find me in the Forbidden West and learn all that I've discovered? Well, oh, I'll confirm you on it. Yes. Well, the coordinates make it simple enough, even for you. What's that supposed to mean? God. We need to put an arrow through his knee. That's what we need to do. No more adventuring for him. It's not our choice. They're not gonna like this. You went inside it, and it transformed, almost like the day of the battle. I can only be grateful that it's a stormy day. Few will have seen the tower change from Meridian. What did you discover? Hades. The danger didn't end here. It went into the Forbidden West. And I have to follow. I see. But that can be difficult. The West is called Forbidden for a reason. A tribe of ferocious warriors controls much of it, the Tanakh, and they allow no trespassers past its border. That said, under the Sun King of Ard, a fragile peace has been negotiated, and indeed, Discuss. the next embassy will take place in a day or two on the edge of the frontier. Were you to attend the gathering under his auspices, the Tanakh might grant right of passage, instead of hunting you and attacking on sight. Great, just what I need. More killers. Ah, the Sun King. We're gonna finally see him again? Hey! Yeah. He has a son? It's good to see you. You left in such haste. We never had a chance to properly thank you. Can, can we show the champion the spear now? Please? He's a man. Quiet. It's true. We bear gifts. Decorum usually calls for a ceremony of offering at the palace, but I thought you would prefer a less formal occasion. Bring them, please. He knows Although us well. This is all very kind, but I... Who's it? Vinasha. Quick. Better hand them over before she runs off again. <laughs> really? Must you? That is a... That's a beautiful... Spear thing. Try it on. It's beautiful. On behalf of all the citizens of the Sundom, may these tokens remind you of our eternal gratitude. Aww. Perhaps you'd like to spend more time with your friends. Come speak to me when you're ready to depart. I kind of want to go depart already, but at the same time, I kind of want to find out what they're going to say. So, learn more about characters from the past. Navigate to the character bios section in your notebook. To my new spear. Should be a workbench around here I can use. Workbench. Tracking. Workbench. Let's talk to him, to Avad. <coughs> the sculptor wanted something even bigger, twice the size, covered in gold and jewels. Aloy wouldn't like but that. I was quite certain you wouldn't appreciate that. Agreed. You were right. I'm sorry, Avad. It's good to see you. But I can't stay long. I see. I had hoped you'd remain in the city for a time. Perhaps at the palace. Meridian's still in danger. But 
it's bigger than that. To put things right, I have to go west. To Noth territory. I have a son. That's a Noth? Well, perhaps Murad already told you, but... After years of hostility, we've negotiated a truce. In hopes of a lasting peace. Another embassy will be held in just a day or two. Uh... The embassy. What makes this coming embassy so special? <clears throat> Not just like today, it is special. Because of the guest. Our delegation will meet with the Tanakh just outside Baron Light. We'll give them treasure, and they'll return a prisoner. Prashav, one of our finest soldiers. Soldier? Don't you mean raider? No. Not in this case. Fashav is my cousin. Nothing like Helis and his ilk. He joined the Western Expedition with the hopes of reining in certain excesses. But he was captured during a heroic defense of our forward base at Cinnabar Sands. And has been held ever since. Uh, Fashav. Your cousin, Fashav. How long has he been a Tanakh captive? That was actually my question. Five years. Oh, wow. Tanakh emissaries swear he is well, but I wonder. That tribe is renowned for its brutality. How did he survive? Maybe they're not as brutal as we thought. No, I'll know soon enough. If you see him before I do, tell him that I await him in Meridian, where he belongs. If I see him, I will. So, why years of hostility? When you say years of hostility, I assume you mean the Red Raids? Ah, yes. My favorite subject. I wouldn't ask if I didn't need to know. As you know, my father raided all the border tribes. The Asaram, Banuk, and Nora suffered greatly, resisting as best they could. But none fought back like the Tanakh. They rose up and assaulted our western front at Barren Light, sweeping us from their lands. Getting them to talk to us again after that was tricky. I bet. Uh, do you really hope for peace? How did you get the Tanakh to talk again after the war? The same way I got you to talk. By giving gifts. <laughs> the Tanakh like tiaras? <laughs> <laughs> More like metals, spices, and relics looted during the fighting. We've met with them on several occasions. And the gifts seem to have eased the tension. But this coming embassy is the most important yet. The best sign we've had so far that the Tanakh want lasting peace. Um, Itamen. It, Itamen, I don't know. Itamen looks happy. Itamen, got it. You got him out of Sunfall. Any happiness He's a cutie. he has, he owes to you. <laughs> He's turning into a fine young man. Which he'll need to be if he's to inherit the crown. When the crown go to a son of yours first? Yes, well. I'd have to get married for that to happen. Murad <laughs> keeps throwing noble matches at me. But I find I'm always... trying to make them into someone they're not. He likes her, I think. At any rate. She's I never blushing. aspired to the throne, and I don't wish to sit there forever. When Edaman comes of age, I hope to step aside. Free of the crown. I might finally be able to travel the world. Who knows? Perhaps even accompany you on one of your adventures. You make it sound easy. <laughs> uh, I guess it's time for, to go. I need to get going. Uh, one moment, Aloy. There's something I must ask you. Since you left, I've thought of little else. This isn't really the time. But it has to be. The way you left before, there's no way to know when I'll see you again. I'm not trying to stop you. Or hold you back. But I need to know. When your mission is over, will you return to Meridian? And stay? Long enough for us to... Spend time to get to know each other properly, perhaps. He is a gentleman. Uh, flashpoints offer moments of emotional choice. 
How Aloy expresses her personality is up to you. Choose uh, to confront the challenge directly. Brain, uh, insight to clever, less obvious approach. Love, compassion or give. Voice your deepest convictions. If I'm being completely honest, he's a gentleman and everything, but he doesn't seem like Aloy's type. Not to assume what she's into, but... It's just, they're polar opposites, no? Um... I don't want to say it's a nice thought. I don't want to give him hope. But I'm going to say now is not the time. Avad, the, the situation calls for a, a higher perspective. The threat I'm facing endangers not just Meridian, but a lot of other places too. A lot of innocent people. What happens between us, it's not important. At least, not yet. You're right. I think she's into him. Maybe. I'm like a fool. It's supposed to be the king who calls for a higher perspective. Please accept my apology. And my wishes for your success. Goodbye, Aloy. As always, our hopes ride with you. He is a gentleman. He's a good dude, Ben. I like him. Okay. Looks like a memorial. For what? Or who? Honoring those who fell in the Battle of the Alight. Lots of brave people defended this place from Hades. Man, this is remnants from the Battle of the Alight. I remember this so much. We were almost overrun by the machines Hades controlled. But we pushed through. Man, it's bringing back memories. So I think... I think that's me leaving. I want to finish talking to everybody before I do that, though. Hello. Dowager Queen Nasadi. Blessed champion. Itaman, what do you say? She looks beautiful. My humblest thanks to you, great champion, for delivering my mother and me from Sunfall and for defending our holy city against the forces of shadow. Did I say right? <laughs> I said it fine. <clears throat> and you're welcome. Champion, will you teach me how to shoot like a real machine hunter? It's a man. I, uh, I have to go on an important mission, Prince. To save the world? Something like that. Pretty much, though. When I come back, I could give you a few tips. It would be an honor. We owe you our lives, champion. And we will not forget. May the sun light your way. Watch out for Thunderjaws, champion! I will! He's a cutie, man. Okay, so... Looks like we got one thing over here. Oh, it's more... The Deathbringer we defeated. The Deathbringers. Those things were insanely tough. The machine was the last line of defense for Hades. It dragged the orb up here and then nearly killed me, but... It's just a piece of scrap now. Good. That's what it gets. I'm assuming it's the statue. It's a cool looking statue, man. I really wish I had that statue. I guess I should be flattered by the statue. It feels wrong. Especially when my job's only half done. That's that's fair. It's not done. You'll earn you'll earn that statue, Aloy. There. A workbench. Wait, before I do that. Uthid, Fanasha. Thanks for being here. Wouldn't miss it. Even if you did leave us hanging after the big battle. <laughs> stop. She's here now, isn't she? For the moment. But I see that look on her face. Yep, I'm She's got deuces. Business to attend to. And it isn't in Meridian. You know, Smart. I didn't vanish before because I wanted to. I had no Huntress. Please. You don't have to justify yourself to us. You saved our butts. If you've gotta go, go. With our blessing. 
Thank always. you. How have you guys been? You both look like you're doing well. Mr. Shiny Pants here is now the Sun King's senior military advisor. That means people actually have to listen to him talk. May <laughs> some bless their sorry souls. At least I say something of substance every once in a while. What was that? I just fell asleep while you were talking. <laughs> and how about you, Vanasha? I've been looking after Nasadi and Edaman, two parts bodyguard, one part bad influence. Huh. I was gonna say nanny, but I like your version better. <laughs> She's funny. Uh, what, 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 how's Edaman? I pictured you as a nanny. Edaman must be special. Hold on now. I'm not entirely domesticated. Nasadi was the mad Sun King's wife. She has enemies. I've had to foil a plot or two. Right. You can try to hide it, but inside, you're as soft as a silk pillow. <laughs> oh, you have no idea. Huh? Oh dear. Uh, He's blushing. Talking about Edaman? Yeah. Okay, I admit it. Edaman's cute. He's fun. And he looks up to me. I like him. Except when he forgets to wash his hands after hooking worms in that muddy garden behind a solarium. <laughs> <laughs> Kids. Uh, the Shadow Karja. It's been months <coughs> since I was in Sunfall. What's become of the Shadow Karja? <laughs> After you wiped out the Eclipse, there were hardly any priests or officers left to terrorize the little people. Avad offered amnesty to all who were forced to serve the Shadow. So the commoners cleaned out the Citadel and handed it back to him. The Sundom was unified. Avad wanted Uther to take command of the garrison there, but... Captain Cudley here refused. <laughs> Rumor has it that he wanted to stay close to me here in Meridian. <laughs> That's nonsense, of course. <laughs> I don't think it's nonsense. Farewell. Well, I, I know. I know. You're out. Go. Away with you. Always an honor, champion. Always a pleasure. But please, little Huntress, come back someday and tell us about your adventures. If I can't get in trouble, at least I can hear about yours. <laughs> There's something about them. Okay. Wow. I got the optional quest done. So let's craft our spear. <coughs> that was really hard crafting. I literally just held one button. Master override installed. Plus... Something new to store up and release energy. A uh, resonator should help in a fight. Do I have to craft something else? I thought Jay couldn't get worse. Return. Okay. Whoops. It is. Thank you. For now, at least. Where am I going? Hello. Is that the time? Or do you want to chat some more with your friends? Uh... Hold on. I think I'll take a few more minutes. I gotta look around and make sure there's no... Memories or anything like that, you know? Because the mission was only to check out talk on our friends. I don't see anything. So we should be good, so let's go ahead and get out of here.